Action News, Delaware Valley's leading news program with Dave Roberts, Rick Williams, and Monica Malpass. Millions of Americans are being charged illegal fees to file their federal taxes. That is the allegation of a class action lawsuit filed in Philadelphia. And this, by the way, is a story you'll only see here on Action News tonight. Here's Action News consumer reporter Nidia Hahn. Hi, Nidia. Hi, Monica. The details in our report come from this class action lawsuit just filed today. And if the plaintiffs win, millions of taxpayers could be getting refunds. And perhaps more importantly, this has the potential to change the federal e-filing system for good so that all American taxpayers can e-file for free starting as soon as this coming tax season. Nearly 54 percent of Americans filed their 2006 tax returns electronically. Stacy Byers of Maniunk was one of them. I choose to e-file because it's simple, it's easy. Stacy bought H&R Block's tax cut software for help and included in the price is a fee to e-file. Most taxpayers who e-file end up paying a similar fee even if they file online without additional software. Sometimes the fee is included with other products, sometimes they pay it separately. I had no idea that um, anybody was profiting over paying my taxes. Even if you go to the government's official IRS website to e-file, the government then directs you to one of a number of private companies that has a contract to facilitate e-filing. Companies like H&R Block or Intuit which markets TurboTax. They're called the Free Filing Alliance, and it's a cartel of private companies uh, whose purpose is to make a profit, not to enable free filing, but to stop free filing, and in fact, to charge as much as the market will bear. Stacy is now the lead plaintiff in this class action lawsuit filed today in Philadelphia. The lawsuit alleges the cartel wrongfully charged Stacy and other taxpayers and failed to set their e-filing fees as required by federal law. Everyone has an obligation to pay taxes to the federal government, but they shouldn't have to pay a price, a fee, simply to file their returns, and they certainly shouldn't have to pay a fee to private companies. There is a way taxpayers who meet certain income requirements can e-file for free right now. The IRS says 70 percent of taxpayers are eligible, but only a small fraction take advantage of free filing. For more information on that and this class action lawsuit, go to 6abc.com. H&R Block and Intuit say they cannot comment on the lawsuit because they haven't seen it yet. The Free File Alliance says the lawsuit is without merit. It says the alliance is a pro-consumer public-private partnership that has been a win for taxpayers and a win for consumers. Back to you. All right. Thank you, Nydia.